Hey everybody, this is Eric Clark's Travel Videos, and today I'm gonna to show you a swimming hole. Actually, I'm gonna show you three swimming holes. Um, and they're all right along the wall here, the castle wall of Fort St. Angelo um, in Valletta, right at the very end of Valletta, and they're not very famous. And so if you're looking for a secluded spot to lay out, if you're looking for a secluded spot to swim that's safe, that's pretty easy going, I, you know, I don't know how, how, how easy going these are. This, this isn't a little beach you kind of walk out on, but it's certainly a spot where you could come and lay in the sun and relax and enjoy the current and the water. Um, there's not beach to sit on or anything else. The third one will have a beach, but this one does not. So I'll just go down the line. One, two, three. The second one is Kaboom. <laughs> and I'll show you that one too. And then the third one is the little, uh, the little shack town or something but it, it has a bar. <laughs> Bye everybody. Okay, so what do you think of this? So this, there's a little trail and I've, I've done a video on this. I've walked all the way around the wall. So this is Fort St. Angelo right here and you can walk all the way up and around and you can see the Fort Paraputs up on top and the, the pill bunkers and all that kind of stuff. But there's this little spot. I mean, so this is gorgeous, right? So you could lay out here without a problem. And the view is amazing. So this will give you an idea of where it's at in reference to the lighthouse and to the other little forts. Um, but this little spot right here is just, I, I, you know, to me, this is ideal. Why, why do I think it's ideal? Obviously, <laughs> there's nobody here, which is a big one. Two, it has a wonderful stairs, so you can just kind of jump in. I think it's really deep. I don't think you're going to get near the side, but the water... You can see how clear it is in the middle there. Um, so I'm thinking it's gonna be sand down there, but I, I think it's so deep that you're not gonna reach it. Um, but, uh, and you can see the stairs to get here, up that side, it's pretty, it's pretty steep. And this is on Google Maps. Um, and I have pictures on Google Maps of this place. Um, and so it's really, you know, I don't know. I, I, I think I could swim here without a problem. And again, there's the stairs into the water. And so you could just jump off this side, as long as you make sure you don't hit anything down there on that side. Um, but it's a, a cute little spot. And so it has a name and the name of it is written up there on top of that thing. And I'll go up there and show you. But I just want to take a second and let you soak in the beauty here. And I have seen people swimming here. And the trail is not really that hard. I know that that little section right there looks pretty hairy, but it's not, um, it's not bad. You can come around the castle the other way, this way, and you can see the castle there. Um, and this way is really a simple little walk. This is like a road and there's a road to the left that gets you there too. Um, but if you're in the center of Letta, those stairs are the way to go. Um, and you can see the water is clear. So that means there's sand down there. So you can see the white sand. And I think if you were adventurous and had a little snorkel and a mask and, you know, you could swim around and have a good time and be okay. And look, there's a little fish in there. Now, as for the name, I'll walk up there and get that name for you and uh, put it on the video. Thanks, everybody.
So I don't know if you can see, but you can see the edge of the rock right there. And then you can see the sand down there. I see fish swimming and everything else. Um, and, and I don't think the current's pushing enough to push you into the rocks or anything like that. And obviously people swim here. And that ledge looking from here, it jets out and goes back. So I think you really could jump off without a problem. Um, and so, uh, I don't know. I, I, I think it's a cute little thing. Now, the, the trail here is kind of a tricky one, but uh, I did a video of it and you can see it yourself um, on the video. And it's not bad. I mean, I don't know. It's not like you're gonna fall off or anything as long as you're careful. Um, so the name of this place, let me show you the name. And I don't know what this is or what it says, but it is on Google map. I did look it up. Um, and it's this place right here. Um, can you read that? I can't even see it really. So it's this. And that's what's on Google too. So if you go to Google, you can see it. So it's it Equilamal Gahandi whatever. I don't know. The other side has a little beach to it type thing too that you can get walk out to. And it's all the way down like that. So let me walk up the rest of this and I'll show you the other side. So you can see this side is much calmer and easier. And see, here comes a person to go swimming. So anyway, oh, and there's people down there too. So, okay, well, that's it. So this is place number one. I'll get you the exact name so you can look it up. That's it, I'm moving on. Let's get to number two, kaboom.